Well, yeah, it's, it's been a while since I made a video. It has been a while. Um, I've been busy, you know, just really trying to get in some more bait shops. I want to get, I'm trying to get the, the, uh, the Big Norma Spinner into as many bait shops as I can. I really, I'm really trying to push and push to get that out there. Um, you know, with, so I'd have to say within the past, the past two months, the two months I've got in four, four more bait shops. So that's, that's pretty, pretty exciting. Um, one is in Wisconsin, one is in Illinois, one in Minnesota, and then uh, this morning, this morning I got actually uh, got into another one. Oh wait, no, 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 excuse me. Five bait shops, it's five bait shops. So, Illinois, Wisconsin, Minnesota, now I'm just confusing myself, Minnesota, and then Pennsylvania, and then this morning I got into Maryland. Got into Maryland. So I, within the past two two months, I've got I got into uh, five bait shops. So it's, that's pretty great. I'm excited about that. Um, I know we are kind of leaning towards the end of summer here, um, and then leaning you know coming into fall. So you know it's a it's a great time. You know there's still plenty of time to do some. Know, great fishing um, you know coming up before uh, before it gets too cold at least in the northern parts um, obviously in the southern parts you know you can be doing this all year I just I still can't believe you know I'm watching videos and it's January people in Texas and their t-shirts a sweatshirt and they're going out fishing I think that's just that's like I mean it, you know it just it don't work you know like you just you get so used to Wisconsin here, you know, and you, you're literally, in January, you're, you're ice fishing, or you're not going out at all because it's too dang cold, so. Road closed ahead, what the fuck? Yeah. No, they weren't, they weren't kidding. You gotta be sh So what the fuck? Road. Proceed to 88th Avenue. Less than a mile uh, from where I needed to be, and they have the road completely shut down. Yeah, there it is. That's where I needed to go. All right. Yeah, I can see where I had to turn around. Son of a bitch. All right. Well, it's 10. It is 10 to 6, and uh, just get into the place. Um, okay. Um, oh, got a few people. Got a few boats. I'm all right with that. I feel confident that, uh, you know, something going on out here. One, two, three, three boats. Start out today with the uh, with the big enormous black and white. See if I can get something on that. Try to try to pinpoint what they're into today. This water is uh, pretty pretty dang clear, so we'll have to we'll just see how this turns out here. Alright, I just seen a, that was a, I think it was a rock bass that was biting at my lure there. He was gnawing at it a couple of times. I seen he had that red eye, so that's why I was kind of, like, was it like a, a bluegill? They got a little red, but uh, yeah, I think it was a little, like, rock bass or something. No luck yet. Uh, besides that, uh, that rock bass or whatever it was, um, I'm gonna zoom up here a little bit farther and uh, kind of work the shoreline. See if I can get anything out of there. Um, if that doesn't work, it's 
switch up to uh, crankbait maybe. Try that. Try a little deeper, deeper water. See if they're lurking out in the uh, the abyss. And uh, yeah, hopefully, hopefully I can find something. I'm still, you know, I'm not not giving up yet here, but just uh, gotta switch up the tactic and uh, try some new area. Oh, there we go. That is solid. Okay, try to keep uh, try to keep good pressure on this. Seems like a decent one. Oh yeah, he's burying down too. Hoping this is hoping it's a bass. Yeah, that's a dandy. Please stay on. Not bad. Just got to tire him out here. He's got some weeds on him. Right. Come here, buddy. There we go. Sweet. Oh man, it has been too long. Oh, corner of the mouth. All right. Yeah, just throwing in some thicker weeds here, and uh, you latch right on. Try to get a. Just a quick picture, real fast here, and we'll get him. We'll get him back in. All right, good old uh, black and white big Normus. All right, buddy. Here he goes. All right, number one. Awesome, broke broke my dry spell there. Hell yeah, he definitely he fought pretty good. Oh, pretty good. Um, loosen up my drag just a little bit. That was it was pretty top, man. He was he was fighting. He was not uh he was not giving up. When he got close, man, he really buried down. Um, hopefully, hopefully that's a sign that it's gonna. Hopefully it'll pick up here. Maybe they're, you know, they're coming in now to. Do a little feeding. Oh, there you go. I'd like a six foot wheat on the end of my spinner there. The nice thing about the big normus or just inline spinners in general is you can almost work them as like a as a top water. And I mean, I can see a, there's a ton of weeds in this area, and I'm you know uh, you know maybe one every I don't know ten. 10 15 casts i'm getting weeds on here which is i think is that's pretty dang impressive for how weedy it is oh there we go oh sh missed him son of a bitch. he grabbed it and he took off i seen his tail damn it it was right on the edge of the weed line i don't think he got hooked so well let's cast we'll cast past it we're gonna try that again. He was very aggressive. So, oh, he hit it again. I swear to God, he hit it again. I don't know if he's a little small or what. Third time's the charm. Oh, yep, he came up and smacked it. Oh, sweet. Okay. Yep, they're in the weeds. Oh, it's a pike. Oh yeah, we got a pike. Ooh. <laughs> All right. Not, not too big. He's trying to spit it. I think he, he's got it pretty good. He nailed it. All right, buddy. All right, come on. Yep, yep, yep. Let's see if we can do this. Uh, in a timely, timely fashion. I don't know if I'll need the old, the old players here. Come on, buddy. I think you'll be all right. Just gotta give him a second. All right. I'm gonna actually. I'm gonna take a little. I'm gonna take a gander up again.
Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, I missed him. Damn it. Ah, oh, I see the freaking boil too. Son of a bitch. Alright, we'll try that again, guys. What you want to do is cast past it. So you don't scare him right, in this, right where he is. And you want to swim the bait. The lure right past where you, uh, where you had the hit. Dang it. Right, let me... Get this sunset for a second. Just gotta take. Oh my God! I just got. I just got a fish. <laughs> I was just trying to show you guys the sunset, and I drop. I drop the. Uh, I drop it, and something freaking nailed it. All right, hopefully, hopefully you guys can see me. Wow, he's he is staying down. He's staying down. All right. Yeah. It's a it's a nice bass. I think it's a decent one here. Just come on, stay on. Stay on, baby. Ooh. Come here. Come on. Come on. Yes, sir. Yeah. Number two for bass. All right. Get this, get this GoPro back on here. Well, that worked out. It's got some weird. Can you see that? Some weird spots. You guys, see that? Some spots in the top of his roof. Roof is top of his roof. <laughs> top of his mouth. Roof of his mouth. There we go. I can't speak today, can I? There we go. That one's a little better. He didn't. He didn't inhale it like that pike. So uh, came out. Came out a little easier. Oh, oh, I got one. Come on, stay on there, baby. Casting in the... Oh, what is it? Smally? It's not Smally, is it? Oh, it's a smaller bass, I think. Come here, buddy. Come here. Come on. I'll get you. I'll get you. There we go. Sweet. Right at the bottom of the lip. You guys see that? Awesome. That is... Bad ass. I wanted to catch one more before it got too dark. Sweet. There, oh, mosquito too. Yeah, they're coming out now. There we go. <laughs> a little small. It's alright though. He fought. I thought he was uh, small for a second. He had that kind of bronze color to him. Alright, buddy. Get you back in there. See ya. No idea. All I know is that's a song. I don't even know. It's some kind of dirty dance move, I think, right? I don't know. It could be... Oh! Ooh! Got another one. There we go. What? Okay. Okay. We got a new species here. This is what I seen earlier. I'm pretty sure this is... Okay, buddy. This guy's a little warm. Yeah, see, this is what I seen earlier. A little rock bass, I think. Is it a, I'm trying to think of... Yeah, it's a rock bass. I guess I would catch these in a in a river I fish quite often, but they'd be a little bit different color. Sweet. That is awesome. All right. You guys are coming out to play now. Check this. If you can see it. You guys see that? His his eye color. You know, got that real, real red. If you guys can see that or not. Cool. All right. We'll get we'll get him back in here. We won't. All right. What do you? He's got to be what seven inches? Not bad, right? <laughs> he's a little buddy, bloody, but he'll be all right. There he goes. I think he's swimming underneath the kayak there. Okay. Yep. That's that's not good. That's not good. I think I might. Oh, let's see. I might have uh, just 
did myself in there. Yep, I just snapped it. Well, let's, we'll just take a second here. All right. Well, wrapping it up. Had a pretty good night um, before these mosquitoes came out. Getting lit up here. Um, oh my God, they are all over. But uh, yeah, three three bass and one pike. And uh, oh yeah, and that uh, that rock bass too. That was pretty cool. Um, just uh, see if see you guys take a look at that moon there. I don't know how that looks on the GoPro, but uh, yeah, pretty cool. It's got to be close to a full moon, right? Pretty neat. All right, well we'll paddle back here and uh, get this on the road.